Yo, what is up guys, this is Ripper and here with a new video for you guys today and guys, listen, before we hop into today's topic, I just want to set up something real quick. Thank you guys for the love and support recently, it means the world for all the people that found my channel recently, welcome. I know recently I've been seeing a uh, few new faces here and there on some videos. Recently I've been having a lot more new faces show up to the YouTube channel and show support on the video, so uh, real quick, I just want to say thank you to you all, you all mean the world to me. And thanks to you guys, we are growing back our community that we did take a little break from, and uh, specifically on YouTube. And I'm glad to see it essentially reform and the fact that you guys are still here. I just want to say thank you, and I hope you enjoyed the content. But on that note, let's hop straight into today's topic because it is really, in my mind, important. And it's a more positive topic than I feel like some of my, my, some of my most recent videos. As you guys know, uh, we are getting a new season too soon in Call of Duty Cold War, that means the Cold War multiplayer, that means Warzone, and there's a lot of things into it, and I'll, I'll put something on the screen real quick for you guys real quick now, so you guys can kind of understand what's involved with it, because there is a lot in it, and you know, I'm just gonna skim past that a little bit and talk about uh, what we can see for this future of Call of Duty, because with all that coming in, we're getting six new guns, or not guns, but weapons, essentially. And what, three new multiplayer maps and all that stuff. We're getting all these things, right? And, you know, they are really trying to heavy push this, and I'm all for it. I'm all for a new season, obviously. You know, if you want to watch me play the new season, I'll, it'll be my Twitch, twitch.tv slash xripper. I will literally be playing the new season on Twitch if you want to check it out. Also, I'll be uploading some stuff on YouTube as well, so be sure you're subscribed and have the bell notification on to be on the lookout for that. But, you know, there's a lot coming with this. And one of the new things they're adding was Snipers Only. They added Snipers Only back. And it brought the question to my mind of, why are we going to take away something that people want, right? You know, we're getting this snipers only game mode that people are really excited for when it first came out people were really hyped it, it was really popular and rightfully so it was a great game mode and then they just took it away from us and then they brought it back now and what main point i want to get to in this video is just talk about a way to sir a way to revive multiplayer on a positive note right because i think there is a way to revive multiplayer and one of those things that i've been thinking about a lot recently is let's Let's look at these game modes that people really like, right? We have like a prop hunt, sniper hunt, or sniper only. And then in Warzone, we have like uh, plunder quads, plunder trios. Like we have all these things that people really do enjoy, especially Warzone players who do multiplayer. But then we just get it removed and brought back, removed, brought back, and it's the same life cycle. And I've been thinking about it. Why don't we just keep it, right? Because I think long-term, this would be the most marketable decision they could go down. And maybe I'm crazy, but I feel like, let's just be honest here, if we had sniper only permanently in the game mode, who wouldn't play it? You know what I mean? Like, who wouldn't like that? I know for me, if I ever need a break from Warzone, shit, go to sniper only. I need a break from League Play, which let me tell you guys, League Play has been pretty crazy. I go to sniper only, right? It gives me something to do. Right, and you know, when they brought a warp prop hunt in, let's think about that, when they brought prop hunt into the game, we all were very excited and they kept it, right? Because they all knew we would like it. But then I think at one point they took it away and then it's still there now. So like, they decided to keep that. But like, why don't we get something like a permanent snipers only? And why don't we get to just experience a mode that we want to play? And again, Maybe I'm wrong on this, but I just feel like if we as a community want something done here, it'd be really nice if we could just keep our game modes that we like. And you know, Call of Duty has been in this path of kind of a weird state of up, down, and let's be honest, the years of COD's just gone downhill, right? But there's ways to keep it in a safe place, in a safe reviving place, and that's, let's keep the game modes we want. And if you guys haven't played Snipers Only, by the way, uh, try it out. It's so good. So, so good. It's a lot of fun. I personally think it's one of the best game modes they have out currently. And arguably one of the most enjoyed and hyped up ones. Because let's just be honest, most of the Call of Duty community nowadays is sniper based. Even, 
even it's crazy even cdl league like there's so many snipers in cdl league which is kind of cool but it's just the point that the reason that is is because people love it people love sniping like that's a big foundation of call of duty and i feel like if they kept that man let's just be honest we'd all be so happy let's keep you know let's keep the modes we like let's keep the modes we want this idea really sparked with me and, and i i want to just hear your thoughts on this this may be a shorter video or a more i should say specific topic video but i just want to know your thoughts on this so put it do me a favor put in the comments below do you think this is a way that essentially could save multiplayer because multiplayer really needs a save do you think this could be a way to save it or do you think that it's smart for them to you know bring it in game and then take it away and then bring it back again as like a hype up method right so let me know down in the comments do you think it's a good idea or bad idea with the direction they're going with it specifically and i'll definitely be sure to respond to all the comments on that because as a community member of call of duty who's been in this community for almost what eight years now i think it is eight or nine years i can tell you there's a lot of stuff that i've seen change there's a lot of stuff that i have seen them do that does and doesn't make sense and so if we as a community can get a general consensus i think that'd be the most awesome thing as a call of duty community and i'm never going to give up on call of duty but i'm always but i'm always going to be the person to give a judgment decision if i really need to say something and this is something i really wanted to talk about so if you guys did enjoy today's video, again, do me a favor, put it in the comments your thoughts. Do you think that they should or shouldn't be doing this direction? And if you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe if you are new, turn on the bell notification, and check me out on Twitch again, guys. Uh, please, I've been on that grind for four to five days. It's been kind of crazy. Um, four to five days a week right now. And uh, if you want to watch me play some Call of Duty, I play a lot of Warzone. Obviously, Warzone's my main game currently. So if you do want to go check that out, it will be in the description. And other than that, I love you all. And I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, guys. Peace.